happy Thursday. Today we are going to make something really fun. Mom and dad might not love it, but I am sure you will. We are making a catapult. Yep, your very own catapult. And all you're gonna need is about three or four things. It's really, really simple. So you first want 10 jumbo popsicle sticks. Um, you do want the jumbo ones because they definitely work better. You need three elastic bands. Um, they don't have to be thick ones, you can just use regular ones. Uh, you're gonna need a pair of scissors. I recommend using a like pop bottle cap or a water bottle cap or something like that, a cap of some kind. Um, and then whatever you're gonna fling. Today we're gonna use marshmallows because they're kind of fun um, and that's what I've got. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is take eight of your 10 popsicle sticks and put an elastic around each end of them. And you wanna make it really tight. So we're just gonna do that together. And I put mine around three times and then you're gonna do it on the other end. That's that. And now I'm just gonna set this aside until we the need it. The next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your two popsicle sticks and you're gonna cut a notch on either side of them, just on one end um, in the side. If you have a big sister, mom and dad, grandma and grandpa, aunts or uncle, somebody to help you out, I would recommend having them help because it is a little bit difficult. Um, but if you are confident to do it, just do take your time. It does take a minute or two. It doesn't have to look perfect. This is what I've done, and I'm gonna do the same thing on this one. So mine aren't perfect, but they're pretty close to being the same size and in the same location. It's not a big deal if they're not perfect. Don't worry too much. So we're gonna grab our little stack of, um, of popsicle sticks, and now the fun part. You're going to take your one popsicle stick and put it right below the top one. So that's what it looks like. And then you're gonna do the same thing on the other end. This should be your finished result. Your two notches are gonna line up to each, with each other or as close as you can get with the majority of your popsicle stick sticking out to one side. The next thing, and the, it's kind of the last step of putting this together, is you're gonna take your, that's not the last step, it's the third, it's almost the last step. You're gonna take your last elastic and you're just gonna put it right around where the notches are. The notches are just there to keep your elastic in place. I recommend putting this, it's gonna be hard. Um, I recommend getting as many times around the popsicle stick as possible with your elastic band. It's just gonna make your catapult a little bit stronger. So, last and final step is you're gonna want to attach your cap onto your catapult. I'm gonna use white glue if you've got a glue stick or a glue gun, um, like hot glue, you can use that also. Um, if you are using white glue, um, I would recommend leaving it and letting it wait for a little while before you try and use it, because uh, you really want that glue to dry. And this is our finished product. It's super, super simple, um, but let's see if it works. <sighs> Time to test out our catapult. Um, so all you need to do is set it up, which is just putting it down on the table somewhere or on the ground, grabbing your, um, your ammunition. Um, I'm again, just using marshmallows. If you've got, um, what else is there? Pom-poms or, um, little bouncy balls or things like that, feel free to use those. Um, I recommend using something soft so you don't hurt anybody. Um, but yeah, so we're using marshmallows today. I'm just putting it. We're gonna put our ammunition in the catapult and then fling it away. Woo! We'll do a couple. And see how far and high they can go because different ones have gone different lengths depending on how far I pull it back. 
So obviously they work. Tell us how far you're able to get your uh, catapult to go. If you set up two of them, you and your siblings um, can make a whole reenactment um, using catapults and um, army guys or Legos or things like that. So we would love to see it. Tag us on Instagram or Facebook if you take any pictures um, or if you want to tell us about how great they are. Thank you so much for tuning in today and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thank you.